Am I gay? I don't know. I haven't taken the quiz yet, so I can't be sure. Uh, I would say that I'm straight. My girlfriend seems to think that I'm gay. We argue about it pretty much every day, so I feel like the only way to truly settle this is to just take the quiz. We're gonna start it. I haven't previewed any of the questions. I don't know how long it is. We're just gonna get right into it, man. Start the quiz. Have you ever had feelings for a same-gender close friend? Nope. Have you ever kissed someone or wanted to kiss someone of the same gender? Don't ask why that took so long to answer. How do you feel about queer characters in TV shows and movies? Oh, I've totally watched shows just for the queer ships and story. <laughs> I kind of feel like I can identify with queer characters. I notice queer characters, but I don't feel strongly about them. I like the positive representation, but they don't stand out next to me. Or I mean, they don't stand out to me. Um, I definitely do notice them. It's kind of hard not to, because they're usually super queer. So we'll say next on that. When someone asks you who you're crushing on, a name comes to mind immediately and it's someone of the same gender. I make up a name or pick someone random. I literally don't get the big deal about crushes. <laughs> I talk about someone of the opposite sex who I'm genuinely crushing on. Uh, yeah, that's what I do. And if my girlfriend asks, I zip the lip. Has anyone ever asked you if you were gay? Um, people do assume that about me all the time. It's true. Usually gay people do. When I was in high school, there were several of them. One of them just like walked up to me and just started trying to unbutton my shirt. <laughs> that was the thing that happened. Uh, so yeah, yeah, that, that is something that occurs. When you imagine being in a relationship, what do you picture? I can only see myself with someone of the same sex. I'm not sure any gender seems okay. I'll probably be with someone of the opposite sex. I can only see myself with someone of the opposite sex. Well, here's the, it's, it's an imagination, you know? Like, you can imagine something that's totally beyond the realm of your wanting to do that. You know what I mean? It's like, if I imagine being in a relationship, I could picture me with a dude. I just wouldn't do it. Because that's gay. You know? But, uh, yeah, I can only see myself with someone of the opposite sex. How would you feel about identifying as gay? <laughs> yeah, that feels right. Oh, well, I mean, dude, if you answer this question this way, why do you need the rest of the quiz? You nailed it. You got it. Why did you even come here? It honestly makes me a little nervous, but also kind of fits. I'm not sure how I feel. No, I really don't. Eh, I really don't think that's me. Sorry. Have you ever felt attracted to someone of the same gender? Yeah, but I'm not gay. How do you feel about dating someone of the opposite gender? Not interested, that would feel like a chore. I wouldn't mind, I've either wanted to do it or have done it. Maybe, but I'm not really interested. I definitely date or have dated, yeah, I definitely date or have dated someone of the opposite gender, of course. Do you ever fantasize about being with someone of the same gender? I mean, not willingly. Not like on purpose. My brain does this thing where like, it flashes unpleasant thoughts like in front of my eyeballs like sort of like a flip book you know like you imagine a flip book where it's like <laughs> and like all the pages are doing like that's basically what it happens is that like every 10 or 15 seconds i will have a thought for like half a second that i don't want to have that's just my brain and my imagination kind of hold me hostage sometimes they just kind of like pin me down and force me to look at things that i don't want to entertain that might be like a mental health thing that maybe someone should uh, be talked to about, but is is can I add a qualification here? Like, yeah, pretty often, but like I don't wanna. <laughs> so, is there a can I add to the end here that like yes, but it's not my idea, and also I want it to stop. When you imagine kissing or being intimate with a future partner, how do you feel? As long as I'm with someone I really like, that sounds great. Good, I guess. Can't imagine that. Don't think I'd ever want that. Too young for that. Damn. Dude, asexual people. I don't know what's going on with you guys, but you are missing out. It is too bad that you feel that way. Uh, as long as I'm with... Yeah, I'm, I'm... Well, I mean... Well, no, you don't even have to do that. It's just... It did... Where's the answer where it's like, that sounds great, period? No beginning qualifier. I, good, I guess. Sure. Like, good regardless of circumstance, I suppose. 
If you scroll through your feed or F... What is FYP? What is that? Does that mean I'm not gay? Because I don't know what that is. What is an FYP? I'm going to look that up right now. For you page. Oh. Yeah, see, I don't know that because uh, when I'm on Twitter, I switch it to following. I don't want to see this, like, other shit. Uh, do I see content from queer creators? I mean, I wouldn't know. You can't really know unless that's, like, the whole reason they exist is to be gay in front of your face online. I mean, sometimes it depends on the day, I guess. Flash forward five years, how likely is it that your partner is the same gender as me? I mean, I hope she stays the same gender as me. Or, I mean, as the same gender as she is. Shit, dude. I ruined the joke by making another joke by accident. Yeah, that's very likely. I hope that she would talk to me before she made a decision such as that, but... I want to say very likely. Would you be comfortable using an LGBTQ plus dating app? Uh, no. <laughs> No, thank you. Dude, it's one thing if it's someone you, like, actually knew from school. It's another thing if you're just, like, gonna let some random dude, like, get into your DMs. Like, oh, do you have a mirror in your pocket? Because I can see myself in your asshole. Like, what? Hell no, dude. We got no rapport, and I'm not gay, so... <laughs> Are there a lot of LGBTQ plus individuals in your friend group? Uh, well, there used to be when I had friends. There used to be one or two. Is that a lot? A few good friends of mine identify as whatever. Sort like that did happen. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna go, it makes me look better. I'm gonna go with this one because this is how it was when I was in high school when other people mattered to me. What inspired you to take this quiz? I think I might be gay, but I wanted some extra validation. I identify with aspects of the queer experience. I'm just curious about the result I'll get. I want to conf Dude, if you want to confirm that you're heterosexual, you're gay. If you pick this one, you're gay. If you pick this one, you're gay. If you pick this one, you're gay. Uh, if you're just curious about the result- This is the only straight answer, is I'm just curious about the result I get. This is the straight answer, and this is the open, like, non-homophobic answer. So, uh... You know, I'm on the right side of history, so I'm gonna pick that one. What are my results? You're probably straight. Told you, Christine. It sounds like you're into people of the opposite sex and don't really relate to common queer experiences. I mean, I said I've been attracted to dudes before, but I guess that doesn't matter to you. You just want to put me in a little box. We have a follow-up question for you. Uh, no, I don't want- no follow-up questions. You got me for the one quiz. I'm not getting hooked into another quiz. I don't know, this should be extremely unsurprising to everybody. Like, that's- this is what I would- that's what I would take away from this. Even with some of the things I've said, or have said, or will say, or will think, or do think, or constantly fantasize about, I'm probably straight. Okay, that's all- that's all you guys need to know.